Belgium is not producing at all uh, dark chocolate. The special... I will always make time for going to school to teach the children about uh, the, the chocolate. It, uh, we are part of the education of the children for the future generation who's going to be eating chocolate. If you educate them at a good age, like right now, when they're listening and they're understanding and they're questioning so much more, about where things are coming from and how they are made, they will learn that a piece of chocolate is not always what they think it is. And by teaching them in the schools how it is made and where it's coming from, it will bring them awareness later on when they're going to be the consumers. So I love to spend some time in the schools and go around and give some talks about where it's coming from because I think it's the ultimate future buyers of our product. So it's important for the future. Once you know how it's been made, then you're starting to question, is it good that we are polluting the environment? Is it good that we are abusing the social communities and all that? So then after they will not take that as a normal commodity. Chocolate is quite precious in some ways and it needs to be looked after well and we need to look after well also after the farmers and that's a very important thing. So once you teach children when they're going to become the buyers, they, they will think, oh, should I buy that that way and that price? I don't think that's very fair.